I'm here with Yannick Truesdale. Thank you so much, first of all, for being here with me. Yeah, my pleasure. Uh, so let's go right to Gilmore Girls. You've got this kind of ferocity. Uh, it's hard to almost describe you. You're very stoic-faced in a sense. You're, you're, you're stoic is a good way. You know, you don't really crack a smile. Yeah. But where did you kind of come up with the basis for that character? I don't know. To me, it's kind of like a combination of uh, how American view uh, French people, being sarcastic, having an opinion on everything, knowing better than everyone. American kind of feel that way. And it's my read and my take on him. Um, so I guess it's a combination of both. Yeah. So you've got this kind of this very, very strong, thick French accent. Right. Where did you take that from? Was that just like kind of from being in Montreal and hearing everyone speak so well, often? It's a, it's a French, first of all, I'm French Canadian, number one, from Montreal, but the French Canadian accent is a very different one, as you know. It's not like the Parisian French accent. So I had to work on that a little bit to be authentic and not sound uh, like a French Canadian, which was not the character. Um, so there was a little bit of work, but also, you know, speaking French is not so much of a stretch to tweak the French accent, so, yeah. Now let's go to that kind of triumvirate you had. You had Melissa McCarthy with you quite often, yeah. and uh, then Lauren Graham. Yeah. What was it like working with those two people, often in close proximity? Uh, you mean back in the days, or to go back to it? Oh, back in the day, I mean, they're both great, phenomenal actresses, and they also became friends, so to work with people you love, to work with talented people is always a blessing. Um, so I've always had a lot of fun with them, also because we're friends. So that adds up to the, the chemistry, I guess. Now, you're part of kind of an interesting era of TV shows coming back to life. Yeah. We're seeing X-Files, we're seeing 24, we're yeah. seeing all these shows. Curb and your enthusiasm. It curb your enthusiasm. Yeah. So now we're, we're, we've got this rejuvenation of yeah. Gilmore Girls. How was that exciting to revisit? Very exciting because it's something that rarely happens as an actor. When you're done with a part, you're done. You move on to the next project. You rarely have to, well, I mean, almost never have to go back to it. So, and to go back to a show that has, is so loved, and people have watched episode 10, 15, 20 times, so to have new episodes to give them uh, was great. Yeah, I was happy to do it. I just happened to be watching TV last night, yeah. and the Swan episode was on. Oh, really? Oh my God, that's <laughs> early. That's like season one. That's I want to say like it's like the third episode. You're correct. That is season oh, yeah. one, episode three. Oh, Do you have any three. specific oh, memories of that? A lot of people reference that as one of kind of the great comedy scenes of, of the oh, episode. Oh, really? Um, I just remember, you know, the show was brand new, so I was just trying to figure out this guy. How would he react to this? What it meant to be afraid of the Swan? Uh, yeah, I remember like when when you start something new, you're very focused, right? Because you want it, you're, you're searching. I remember that about the episode. Now let's go to one of your favorite films. Yes, we talked about it a little bit before. Whiplash, which is one of, but I, it's just like a really strong, powerful story that really uh, connected with me uh, directly from the moment the movie started. I was in, and I checked out when it ended. Yeah. <laughs> so that's kind of rare. Yeah. It takes you on a true roller coaster yeah. ride with this character, right? Who's yeah. really being bombarded by this brutal teacher. Yeah, but, but it's also about pursuing your passion and doing something you love no matter what and not giving up and standing up for yourself. And yeah, I thought it was a beautiful film. He's very talented, that director. And Damien Chazelle, the director, yeah. actually did a wonderful job with La La Land, which had the same themes, right? Yeah. Very much so. Well, anyway, thank you so much for doing this. You're welcome. Sure.